There is not much better than the smell of fresh baked bread. And for locals on Arthur Avenue in the Bronx, a mainstay restaurant there has been providing that sweet smell for a century. But the story of Madonia goes even further back than that and back to another country. Lauren Glassberg went to the bakery to find out more. On Arthur Avenue in the Bronx, the fresh bread at Madonia Bakery has a following. Once a month I come up here. We used to live in the neighborhood, but not anymore, so. But the bread beckons. Oh, yes. And it's been beckoning for a century. The fact that it's 100 and in the same family, I think is pretty special. Peter Madonia is the third generation. His father carried on what his own father started. Originally, the round bread was the draw, but these days... It's a prosciutto bread. It's very much about the specialty breads, something baker Charlie LaLima introduced. Jalapeno bread, fennel raisin bread, uh, cinnamon raisin bread, and during the year we make Irish soda bread. The olive bread is the biggest seller, and while they won't tell us how many loaves they sell, they do go through about 300 pounds of olives a week. We want to sell an olive bread, not a bread with olives. It's really, really delicious. No one else sells it like that. The locals love it, and so do the tourists. That is amazing. That, and I'm from Texas, I don't get this. Peter spent much of his life working in government and then for the Rockefeller Foundation, but he's back at the bakery at least until the next Madonia takes over. I have nieces and nephews and cousins, and somebody's going to step up, um, but I think it'll be around for a while. An immigrant dream that rose into a legacy.